while rallies and protests popping up across the country, including a peaceful rally planned today right here at home. WLWT News Size Andrew Setter is leading the way with more on what's planned in downtown. Andrew. Well, Lisa, what's planned downtown here at the federal courthouse is being called a peaceful rally. That's the message from organizers and the hope from Cincinnati police as well. The scenes that we have seen out of Ferguson, Missouri, something no one wants to be repeated in other cities. The leader of the local chapter of the National Action Network, Bishop Bobby Hilton, is organizing tonight's rally. In a statement, the group says they are frustrated that an unarmed individual has gone, the death of an unarmed individual has gone unchallenged by the legal system. He calls out local cases, including the death of John Crawford in Beaver Creek and the death of Samantha Ramsey in Boone County as examples of other cases. Cincinnati's police chief says officers will be ready for any trouble. We're all upset. We're all frustrated. Some of us even angry. But we must make sure that we're doing things properly. We must not harm any individual. We must not harm any property. But we must let our voices and our frustration be heard. Uh, we don't want to be inflammatory. We, we are not going to be in riot gear or anything like that. We don't think we need that here. And we're hopeful that it remains that way throughout the duration. 5 p.m. this evening here outside the federal courthouse in downtown Cincinnati, the Cincinnati chapter of the National Action Network calling this rally Hands Up for Justice. They plan on similar protests outside federal courthouses all across the country. Reporting live from downtown, Andrew Setters, WLWT News 5.